To find the area of the following figure, what we have to do is calculate the area of the triangle on the top and the rectangle at the bottom. We are going to treat this problem as two separate problems. Once we find the area of the two shapes, by adding the area of those two shapes together, that will give us our answer. Let's start by finding the area of the triangle at the top of our shape. To find the area of any triangle, that is found by multiplying the base of the triangle times the height of the triangle and dividing that product by 2. But first we must identify what the base of our triangle is and the height of our triangle. The base of our triangle is located from this point to this point. Although there is no number written directly by this line, we can clearly tell that it is equivalent in length to this line right here because opposite sides of rectangles are equal. Because this side is 12, we know the base of our triangle must also be 12 and the height of our triangle is 3 inches. Now that we know the dimensions of our triangle, we are going to multiply those together. The base of our triangle is 12 and we have to multiply that by the height of 3 and take that product and divide it by 2. 12 times 3 is 36 and 36 divided by 2 is equal to 18. So we now know that the area of our triangle is 18 square inches. Now we have to calculate the area of the shown rectangle. This side of our rectangle is 6 inches and this side of our rectangle is 12 inches. Multiplying 6 by 12 will give us the area of our rectangle and 6 times 12 is 72. So the area of our rectangle is 72 square inches. Now that we have the area of our rectangle and the area of our triangle, we must add these areas together. So after adding 18 square inches to 72 square inches, we come up with a total of 90 square inches, which is the area of the shown figure.